Uh, thank you guys and today we have a new hive that we want to install this is our new hive and we have to make sure that there is no dust inside we scrub the hive using the lemon grass leaves so that it can smell nice for the bees to colonize the, the new hive as you can see all the frames have the starter comb this is the starter comb here you see and this is our lemongrass leaves to remove the dust that the hive is just from the the workshop and it has some dust inside bees don't like the dirty place or the dusty place to stay so we have to make sure that our hive smells nice all the corners by removal of the dust and these small uh, spiders you see here this might make your, your hive not be, to be colonized after dusting the hive those are the most things uh, most people uh, forget to do you find your hive staying for almost one year without bees so I'm going to install this hive today and see whether we have bees today or tomorrow. Luckily, it might take uh, three to four days for your hive to colonize. Depends on the swarming season. Then you put your frames inside carefully without breaking the starter comb so guys if you are new here consider to click the subscribe button and share our content guys for those guys who need the apiary design we have a plan for 50 hives a design for 100 hives a design for 150 hives and a design for 200 hives if you need the design please check on the number below the number is 0728-549727 after closing your hive make sure that the entrance is clean enough it's so clean as you can see then open your hive now you carry your hive will show you the measurements the height and the the levels you put your hive now reaching here uh, you make sure that your hive is above eight meters from the ground <laughs> This is where I normally catch my bees, so I have to put my hive here and the entrance must face the south pole or the north pole. This side is the east and this side is the west. So let's wait and see how this hive will colonize today or tomorrow. Wow guys. Ah. Uh, like an hour ago and you can see the scouting bees are already here trying to make sure that the hive is in good condition for the next colony to come this is just one hour ago and uh, i have not changed everything and it is today let's wait maybe a miracle might happen the bees can colonize this hive so let's wait, give, give them uh, another one hour I can see some bees around me and I'm just here at the compound, meaning there is a swarming team that is coming right now. Let's wait. For you to, to maintain your bees, you must provide them with a forage that they like. Like now, this one is a, a, a angel's trumpet, and in the evening, it produces a, a nice scent that bees like. You'll find uh, from 5 to 7.30, bees mostly come and uh, gather this place. 
to pick the pollen and it's so nice eh? you can see guys so keep on uh, planting uh, uh, flowers that bees like around your apiary thank you guys uh, today being a second day for the hive and I'm told uh, that this hive was colonized around 1 p.m. 1 10 p.m. today and yesterday we showed you the processes of installing the hive so I'm told that this hive has just received uh, a colony that was just uh, checking yesterday with the scouting bee and it is now fully colonized the good thing you need to maintain is the direction and the levels of the hive so thank you guys for watching thank you for subscribing and keep on sharing our content so we welcome our new bees into the new hive so it will take three to four days then we take this hive from here we take it to the apiary down there the apiary right now they are inside and they are quiet the first thing you need to do you cross the entrance so there are some bees that are outside you find some something to brush them out so that they cannot sting it but they are, they are, they are not hostile as we might think but now they are just quiet ready to be taken to the apple so guys this hive took us two days to colonize and this is the second day that is ending so they have to sleep there at the apple so that they can record their direction for forage so thank you guys and we appreciate for your subscription after Closing the main door, some bees are outside. When you are new, you need to wear the bee suit. But to me, I understand them. I can just carry them the way they are. You carry them slowly. Put it on the head and you start working very simple to the apiary. Let's see when we reach in the apiary. Remember guys, we normally capture our bees in the compound. We are out of gate one, apiary site, and it's night, Charles from Guaraka. Now we go in. You put them in the apiary. <laughs> now our bees are in the apiary and we have just opened the door. We will come back after one week to check the number of uh, the number of uh, frames they have constructed but we have to make sure that they have constructed six or seven frames other bees are busy here at the next hive you can see the two supers now our bees are inside this apiary this is our second apiary that we have partnered with Miller's Bee Nexus together with Envision and this apiary we are preparing it to carry 200 hives now our bees the following day will register new directions for uh, pollen collection and we will add the super box once they have constructed six to seven frames so for those people who have not subscribed please consider to subscribe and learn more tutorials about beekeeping here in Envision. See you next, guys.